Hey, what's good, y'all? I'm Xavier Prolific, and you know, recently, Ronda Rousey just did an interview with um with uh, uh, Ellen, and you know, she basically was, you know, spilling the guts and telling you know how she really felt about her loss to uh, Holly Holmes, and said that you know she felt alone. She felt like she wasn't shit. You know, she felt that um these are her words. And then she also felt that, you know, she felt suicidal. Um, and, you know, she went into detail as to basically say that, you know, when she got hit, it got to a point where her her her, her measure of distance as to where her hands were from her face, where her opponent was from her, was totally disoriented. And, you know, she really was just in the rain at one point, not knowing, you know, where she was in the sense of proximity of, you know, striking distance to uh, Holly Holm and said that she had to keep up a front like she had her stuff together because of the simple fact that if she showed any weakness, of course her opponent would have just, you know, jumped in, uh, di dived in for the kill, which makes sense. But me, you know, I would have at least tried to call a timeout or something. But I guess when you're disoriented like that, discombobulated, you can't really think straight, unfortunately, which led to her losing that match. Uh, you know, and she did break out in tears in the interview also, which I was surprised to see because somebody of such great strength, mentally and physically, you know, you don't expect to actually show such vulnerability, especially after such a loss, a devastating loss. Uh, I commend her for it. Anyway, leave a comment in the box below. Tell me what you think. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You can also follow me on Twitter. Download the new podcast episode. And for all the rappers out there, you can find the uh, hip-hop instrumentals we got down there below. You can click those links. I'll talk to you later.